morning. Uh, it's Wednesday and that means it's time for some Jamie's local love and she is getting artsy this morning at a studio in the valley where you can master the art of glass blowing. Jamie, you always find the best places. Good morning. You are at Circle Six Studios in Phoenix. Good morning. You know, I was looking for something that was visually appealing and it is just mesmerizing to watch glass be blown and take a look at just some of the things that they have here in the studio here at Circle Six. And this all started from one man's backyard hobby. Uh, John Longo here worked in glass in the glass business and then started uh, playing with it in his backyard. Tell me about that career. Oh, I always was fascinated by glass blowing and wanted to learn. There was nowhere in Phoenix to learn so I built a studio in my backyard and taught myself oh my goodness. and it just kept growing and in 2011 we opened to the public and we just moved into our new space here in January. And so. What's so cool about this space as we take a little walk here is that they are built uh, to have an audience and, and to hold workshops and to let people really share in this experience. And you have something special happening on Friday for Cinco de Mayo. What's that? Yes, the first Friday of every month we do an event. We have just basically it's a big party here called Cold Beer Hot Glass. You come in, we do demos, make great stuff. There's food, you bring a beer with you or some wine and enjoy yourself for a nice party. And we promised the people that I could make a flower. So of sure. course I'm going to have a little help. You're going to make a flower. I'm going to make a flower. <laughs> With Jason's help here, so Jason, what are we working on right now? So I gathered up some clear glass and I'm rolling in green frit, which is a colorant Ooh. that we use to tint the clear glass. Even though it looks orange, it's just because it's about 2,000 degrees right oh, now. Oh, just 2,000 degrees, yeah, not hot at all. So our Arizona summers, <laughs> if I could tell you about the heat that comes out of that door when it opens, man, we, uh, we can handle 115. I think 115 will be fine for us. And then my next assignment is to sit on the bench, which when I was told this, I wasn't quite sure what would happen next. I think he's going to go for another dip of color, and I'm going to get in position here because you have some rules for me, rules and regs, right, of what I'm supposed to be doing? Yes, you won't be using your left hand at all because we don't want you to burn it. Okay. You're going to pick up your tweezers first. Pick up my tweezers. And then this is back in a different oven right now. a little heat in it. Okay. So what now happens? We're just going to go right on the edge and pinch and pull just a little bit every time Jason stops. And these are the petals? These are somewhat the petals. Well, somewhat. Kind of an abstract flower. Okay. Ah! Am I ruining it already? You're doing great. <laughs> oh. Now we're going to push it out or away from you. Okay. Out and away. I like the color, it's so pretty. It's a nice cobalt blue. Okay. Uh, now you can set those down and pick up these diamond shears oh, here. Look at those. You're gonna open them nice and wide. Okay. Leave them open the whole time. Tuck that finger back. Am I good? There you go. There, okay. And we'll just go ahead and pull that stem out. Gorgeous. No soil required. <laughs> That's the kind of flower I like. As long as I, uh, you know, don't break it, it won't die on me. It'll be there for a long time. And that is just stunning. So what happens to this guy next? Over to the can over there and break it off so we can put it in the kneeler. And what does that mean? Uh, it has to get annealed. Otherwise, it'll just blow up after it cools below 750 degrees. And this thing, oh, there you go. Gorgeous. And now what happens? And we just, we're just torching this one spot because it was sharp where it broke off. So we're kind of just using a little propane torch and it softens the edges there. All right, so can we show the camera that flower? So look at that, my friends. I would say we did all right over here. Yeah, you great. did all, a more than all right. E, C. <laughs> Give her an A+. Plus. He paused, so <laughs> it's an A+. Plus. At least a B. At least a B. At least a B. He's a tough grader. <laughs> at least a B on your first try? I call that an A+. Plus. Hey! Good job, Jamie. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks, Olivia. <laughs>